Hello internet world, welcome, welcome to a new video on the Geek and Noise channel. In today's video I'm going to be giving you my review of the Sabrent Thunderbolt 3 to Joule HDMI 2 uh, display adapter. This was very kindly sent in to me free of charge by the manufacturer, they haven't asked me to say anything in particular. I'm going to share with you my honest opinion. As always let's jump straight into it and take a closer look at the product itself. Uh, this is what the product looks like. I'll give you another brief look at the product packaging actually. Uh, this is important. This is a HDMI 2 display adapter. Very important uh, detail there. Uh, normally, or not normally, but about say six months to a year ago when I'd be looking at devices like this, they were just HDMI or HDMI 1.4 I think it was. And they would only support 4K resolution up to 30 hertz. Uh, this particular one from Sabrent, because it's HDMI 2, will support two external displays uh, via Thunderbolt 3 uh, at 60 hertz, so 4K 60 hertz via both of the HDMI sockets. Uh, this is a really nice design, it's a nice robust design as well, nice metal casing, uh, plastic ends, plastic on the uh, back and the front here, a little rubberized feet on the bottom to keep this uh, nice and stable on your desk, and a decent length uh, cable. Normally these are a bit shorter, normally half the length. We've got a little bit more length on this one, which is really nice. This makes it a lot easier to connect your external monitors because you can place this centrally between the two monitors and your HDMI cables will reach a little bit longer. So it's got captive cable, a decent length, uh, probably around about 30 centimeters, and that is terminated in a US uh, Thunderbolt 3 connector. It looks like USB-C, but this is indeed Thunderbolt 3. It will work on Windows or Mac OS if you have the suitable Thunderbolt 3 port. And then the box itself on this end here has got two HDMI ports. Uh, very, very useful. So as I mentioned earlier, you can run both of these. You can run just a single one if you want. So you could use this just as a Thunderbolt 3 HDMI adapter. But the fact we've got two ports here means you can split out to two displays, both running at up to 4K resolution, 60 hertz. Where this really excels is in a really stable image, very, very easy to use and a really well made product. Nice metal casing uh, and it works extremely well. With products like this you want them to just be plug and play. This one is definitely plug and play, really stable image up to 60 hertz and you will see the difference. If you've got a display adapter that only works at 30 hertz and you're using it for anything other than watching maybe a movie back, you will notice a big difference. If you're running at 30 hertz and you're moving your mouse pointer across the screen uh, then you will really see a big big difference when you upgrade to 60 Hertz uh, I've used 30 Hertz adapters before and the mouse pointer sort of jitters across the screen it's really noticeable sometimes virtually unusable but this really does solve that problem so just to recap Thunderbolt 3 on this end here nice metal casing two HDMI ports HDMI 2.0 ports that support up to 4K 60 Hertz. This is from Sabrent, and I can highly recommend it. That's it for my review. If you want to pick this up for yourself, there are links down in the video description. Please do check those links out. There's also a link down there to the Sabrent website, so please do check that out as well. They manufacture a whole range of different products for your computer, including things like some really fast internal and external solid state drives. Well worth checking out their website. Uh, this has been a live broadcast as well. A uh, big thank you to everyone who's tuned in live. I can see plenty of you in the live uh, broadcast, including in the live chat. David Austin, good morning to you. Thanks for chatting as well. Uh, I really do appreciate it. If you're watching this after live broadcast, you got any questions or comments, drop them in the comments section below. Hit that like button, and I'll see you in another video very, very soon.